So, this is officially me. It is, it really is. This is me. The difference is, is that I've created myself as an AI avatar. The difference is, is that I've created myself as an AI avatar, and it only took two minutes. And it only took two minutes. And today, I'm going to show you exactly how to do this yourself. And it's amazing how fast AI is moving. It's like it's moving at the speed of light. At the speed of light. At the speed of light. So this app is called Wonder Dynamics. So this app is called Wonder Dynamics. And it's amazing the technology it consists of. It's gonna simulate everything that you're doing to a T, just like I'm doing right now. Even walking back and forth. As I walk back and forth, it will do the same thing. And this is very easy. So now let me show you exactly how to do this. So I'll first start just by showing you how awesome this app is. All this is done within a browser. There's no need to download a third party resource or anything like that. But it really is this simple. You can basically just click and drag. And so we're going to have specific type of avatars too. For example, there are going to be some that are going to perform better when you're walking, running, or in an environment where there's movement. But however, if you're doing a close up shot like this right here, you're going to want to choose a specific avatar that it's designated specifically for speaking. So you can make one where you're simply just sitting here like this. The one with this specific avatar and this man right here are gonna be the ones you're gonna wanna choose that will show a close-up shot of you or somebody else talking and it's specifically gonna be utilized to have good mouth movement. So what I'm showing you guys today is just something I went through very quickly. Of course, once you have your video downloaded, you can really do a lot more things, add some more details and really get the editing down pat to make it look almost flawless. And so although it's incredibly impressive, don't really focus on the fine details or something might not looking exactly how it should as far as accuracy goes, because the purpose of this video is just to show you guys how amazing and how easy it is now to do things like this. Okay, so over here in my dashboard, you can see I have the videos I showed you guys earlier that you watched. I have actually one that's in progress right now, and you can see it's going to take a little bit of time. It does take time, but good things come to those who wait. Be patient because it's going to be well worth. On the free plan, you only have the opportunity to utilize Wonder Dynamics templates that they have provided for you. You could use their templates and their bots and that's really as far as you can go. Now in order to actually utilize your own created project with your own personal videos, you're going to have to be on their paid plan. So right now I'm just actually on the light plan for now for $19.99 a month. Next thing, all you have to do next is just upload your video right here. You can either click the browser files or just simply click and drag the video you want directly within this rectangle on the left hand side. Okay, so I added my file over here in the left hand side and you can see it's available right here. It's only a quick three seconds. All you have to do next is just click and drag it within this main box right here. Okay, so then now there it is. There is the main video right here and then I have a timeline at the bottom. Now, all you have to do is on the top right hand corner, just hit this next button and it's going to tell you exactly what you need to do. On the right hand side, bottom right hand side, you can see it says choose actor. You want to scan the video for actors. So in this case, the actor will be myself. So hit this scan for actors button right here. And like magic, just like that, it's frame scanning and it's going to put a box around my body and my face and that's going to be the successful scanned actor. And then there's the box. Once it's done, you can see if I hover over it, you can see it completely outlined the actor right here. Just simply select one of these characters. Now watch this. You can see all the options that we have right here. You can see the preview it's going to give you of each AI avatar. So we have Bob right here. Go back to the first one. We have the dummy robot. Okay. And you can see we have beastie bot. And as you click and go over each one, it's going to give you a short preview on what each one can do. Now, notice this really quickly. Now, if I'm over here on Beastie Bot right here, it's going to give me the key characteristics. Hard surface, organic, and realistic. If I click on Sam over here, our friendly alien, it's going to give these characteristics. Organic, realistic, alien. And then a very important thing to keep in mind, this characteristic right here. Supports facial performance and works best with smaller actors. So, supports facial performance is very important if you're going to have a video, a close-up shot like I do in this case of myself talking. The professor, however, has partial facial support, okay? And then we have Sandy over here. This has full support of facial performance. So 
Right now, the full facial performance, we only have really two options, Sam and Sandy. The professor has partial. So in this case, since this would be a close-up shot right here of myself, I think the best option would be to use Sam, the friendly alien. So all you have to do next in this case is on the right-hand side, all you have to do now is just click and just drop Sam in to that frame right there. And just like that, Sam is now assigned to me and it's now going to replace me with the friendly alien Sam, just like that. So now all you have to do next is just click on this next button. It's going to give you the details of 720p. It's going to be MP4 download. And then just hit start processing. And then just like that, you could see over here now in the top left-hand corner, I have two videos processing at the same time. So here's the one that we just did right here. It's at 5% so far. Then you could see estimated runtime is going to be about 41 minutes. Now, one thing to keep in mind is that, yeah, 41 minutes does seem long for just a three second video. Now, mind you, I've done videos before that are like 10 to 20 seconds, and it's about the same similar time frame. So even videos that I did for 10, 12, 20 seconds, it still took about 40 to 60 minutes to generate for me. But nonetheless, listen, it's still going to be worth the wait. And keep in mind, you can actually do other things in the meantime. So as your videos are progressing, you could still do other videos and do other things. I would just leave this page how it is, go work on a few other things, maybe generate some more AI bots, and then come back to it within that 30 to 40 minute time range, check on the status here and there, and then once it's ready, all you have to do is just download it. It really is that simple. So thank you so much for watching this video, and please don't forget to hit that subscribe button because you'll be the first to know when all these videos come out. But until then, we'll see you next time.